Good morning guys. Today we were making banana cupcake. Okay. I have here an overripe banana and three bananas. Okay, and then we have to mash this. Then we have to add our one cup of condensed milk. Okay, and then we just have to mix this. Then I have here another quarter cup of brown sugar three tablespoon of vegetable oil and one teaspoon of vanilla then we have to add two large egg Then we have to add one and three quarter cup of flour. We just have to sieve for this. Together with uh, one and a half teaspoon of baking powder and one teaspoon of baking soda. Okay, and this is our butter. Okay, and we have to set this aside for now. So we have to prepare our molder. I have here a silicone molder because we have to steam this cupcake. So it's up to you if you want to use uh, directly or with a liner. But I have to put a liner on there so it's easy to clean later on. And I have here a pot waiting for the water to boil. Okay. Okay, then we just have to scoop around two tablespoons for the initial. We have to fill this a three quarter full. So maybe two tablespoons in each. cavity or in each molder 
Okay, and then we have to top this with dried cranberries or whatever dried fruit you have. Okay. I just buy this in Walmart. You can add two. Okay, 15 minutes again. Okay guys, this is our banana cupcake that just got out from the steamer. So we have to remove the molder and we have to cool it in our wire rack this is the second batch so for the three bananas i made 15 cupcakes okay and so we have to try our cupcake so which one this one okay so we just have to try now and see what happened look at that it's very fluffy guys look at so if you have banana and you don't know what to do and try to make this recipe it's easy and it's quite simple and hope you like this video and see you next time bye